Hey you, yeah you, are you tired of using instance.new? Well, you came to the right place. Introducing instance.prevised. Instance.prevised works just as good as the old instance.new. If you'd like to give this a try, be sure to go down in the description and get the module code from the pastebin link. As you can see on the screen, this is it. Now, let me show you how to set up this bad boy. First, insert a module script inside of replicated storage. Next, go to the given code, copy it, and paste it inside the module script. Now you can exit that out. Right click on server script service, insert object, script. Now, before we do that, let's rename our module script to instance. Okay, now we can make our variable local instance equals require so we're going to use the require function so we can access our module script require game dot replicated storage dot instance now let's get the function inside of instance so as you can see we have our module which is our table dot prevised so all we have to do is instance dot prevised it's that simple. But you know instance.previse is the same as instance.new. So you could instead of doing instance.new, then you know you make your part. Well, all you have to do is instance.prevised. Yeah, it's that simple. Instance.previse is way more efficient. It sounds so much clear than instance.new. You know what I'm saying? Because instance.previse is the best. So from here, you can make a variable local part equals instance.prevised part. Then, you know, you could also, you could do whatever you want. So, you know, change the variables, you know what I'm saying? Part dot anchored equals false. You know, or let's do true. Part dot parent. Oops, parent equals, oh, well, can't see, I can't type, and I'm making a professional video, kind of, equals workspace. So, you know, you want to be sure to put that part parent somewhere, as you know, we're going to put it in workspace. I'm going to open up workspace, and there we go, we have a part. You know, you can set up the C frame, the position, whatever. It's the exact same as instance.new. Also, what if you wanted to insert a sound? Um, but, you know, let's change the variable name because, you know, it, it's makes sense because it's a sound so let's insert a sound inside workspace as you can see a sound has been given inside of workspace it's been created so yeah how about sticking with instance.previse instead of instance.new right so hope you guys enjoyed 